Hey guys, welcome once again to Tricopedia. Yes, Tricopedia, the dictionary of tricks. And in this video of Tricopedia, I am going to talk about the most powerful trick of eigenvalues. You know, guys, there are several properties of eigenvalue, but few of them are really very important, onto which lots taking them as tricks, lots of their competitive exam question, be it gate, ESC, ISRO, nil it can be handled. And how to combine them to form it as a trick? Let's understand and let's talk about some of the question solving capability also in this video. Right. So here I refer to a combination of three useful properties. Number one is the sum of eigenvalues, which is always equal to trace of the matrix. Trace, as you all know, is the sum of diagonal numbers. Okay, so sum of eigenvalues is a trace of the matrix. The product of eigenvalues is equal to determinant of the matrix. That also you know to calculate easily. And if there is a real matrix, now what is a real matrix? A real matrix is one in which all the elements are real numbers. Okay, then if alpha plus i beta is an eigenvalue, alpha minus i beta is also an eigenvalue. That means if there is a complex eigenvalue, it will be in conjugate pair. It cannot be alone. Right. So, let's have a look into this question. Let us take some questions and then I will add on one important fact also at the end. Okay. So, the eigenvalues of the following matrix and these are expected, uh, you know, similar questions can be expected in competitive exam. Now, do you need to solve? Of course, there is one method beta 1, beta 2, beta 3 method that also I have told you in one of my earlier shortcut tricopedia video, but that also not required because if you calculate the trace, okay, minus 1, minus 1, 3, the trace is equal to 1. Okay, the sum of eigenvalue should be one, one of the method. I'll make it even more simple. What is a more simple method that this is a real matrix. Okay, this is a real matrix. Okay, and for a real matrix, if there is a complex eigenvalue, it must be in conjugate pair. These are not conjugate. These are conjugate, but this cannot be alone. Okay, this is also conjugate, but 5 plus J cannot be alone. So, there is only one option D which satisfies the conjugate property. Okay, alpha plus I beta, alpha minus I beta. 3 is real. Real number can be alone. So, only correct answer is D. Very, very simple. I can say that. And you can check it by the sum of eigenvalue as well. Let's take another example. Minimum and maximum eigenvalue of a matrix are given minus 2 and 6. What is the other eigenvalue? So, very simple minus 2 plus 6 plus that other eigenvalue because sum of eigenvalue is again equal to the trace. And how much is this trace? That is equal to 7. So, this becomes a fourth or lambda should be 3. So, within few seconds, I am able to solve the question. Not necessarily MC it can even be NAT type numerical answer type of question. Let's have a look into it. Okay, the eigenvalues, two eigenvalues of a 3 cross 3 matrix. So, actually 3 cross 3 ke 3 eigenvalue honi chahiye. They have given 2. Okay, that is 2 plus root minus 1. That is 2 plus i and 3. Okay, if there is 2 plus i, right, so there will also be 2 minus i. That is what is the conjugate property telling. Now, what is the determinant of the matrix? It is the product of all the eigenvalues, right? So, it is the product of 2 plus i, 2 minus i, into 3. This is going to be uh, 2 square plus 1 uh, plus i square. So, minus i square that will be 5. 5 3 is a 15. Calculations you can deal but yeah that is going to be 15. Very simple question. Okay. Because we are aware about these pro properties or tricks. Suppose the eigenvalues of a matrix are 1 to 4. Of a matrix are 1 to 4. What is the determinant of A inverse transpose? Okay. Now, first of all they are asking the determinant of A inverse transpose. We should all know that. Uh, this is fundamentals of determinant. We should all know that by taking a transpose determinant is never affected. So, determinant of A inverse transpose is same as determinant of A inverse and what is the determinant of A inverse? It is 1 upon mod A. Now, what is the determinant of A? That is directly related with the eigenvalue. So, it is 1 cross 2 cross 4. So, final answer is 1 by 8. Numerical answer type question to 0.125 I will write down as the answer. Okay, moving ahead to uh, yet another question here. Okay, so I have a next question, a 2 cross 2 non-singular matrix with repeated eigenvalue. Repeated means there is a 2 cross 2 matrix, so both the eigenvalues are same, repeated. Okay, and this is matrix is given to you. Oh, where x is a positive real number, what is the value of x? Okay, again a numerical answer type question. So, we are again very clear that the trace of the matrix that is x plus 4, this should be equal to the Let's say both the eigenvalues are equal and equal to lambda. So, this should be sum of eigenvalues. That is 2 lambda. On the other hand, the determinant of the matrix. So, ye ho gaya trace wala property. Right. The determinant of the proper matrix, we know it should be equal to the 4x minus minus 9 square, the 4x plus 9. And that is product of eigenvalue. That is lambda square. Now, guys, two variable, two equation. You can solve it up easily. Once you solve, you will get lambda as 1 or 7. Okay. But putting down the lambda as 1 or 7, okay, the value of x that is going to come. So, if lambda when will 1, x will be minus 2. If lambda is 7, 14 minus 4, x will be 10. But x is a positive real number. So, minus 2 is not possible. That is why lambda equal to 1 not possible. So, lambda should be 7. But they are asking x. x is equal to 10 is the very correct answer.
Okay, simply solved. If you have understood, okay, once one more M MCQ question I'm giving just by using the option elimination method, you should be able to solve this question. And what you have to do, you have to solve it on your own and comment the answer in the comment box. We will also reply whether your answer is correct or not. So be active and comment your answer in the comment box and also do comment how did you like this particular trick. And one important fact at the end, all of these questions, exactly all of these questions are gate previous year questions. So I wanted to show you this is just not some properties, but combining two, three properties and making as a trick directly gate questions are solved within seconds whether it is mcq nat and even msq questions also this can be applied so do not forget to subscribe to baiju's example channel if you want to attend more such tricks without a miss thank you